Hi, I'm Pastor Billy Burke, and I have got a word from the Lord for you this week. Am I ever excited for this word to get into you? It's found in Psalm 119, verse 89. Forever, O Lord, thy word is settled in the heaven. Have you ever heard somebody say, I said it, and that settles it? What God is saying here is, is that my word is the final say-so, the final authority in everything. Why is that so important? Because every day of our life, we live in a world of opinion. We live in a world of discovery and exploration. We live in a world where everybody has something to say. And so many have just set themselves up to be, well, you know, right. <laughs> and we have people following people, ending up at a dead end street. It's so important that you realize is that when you begin to move ahead in life, is whenever you begin to respect everybody, you know, whether they're famous or wealthy or whether they live on the street and they're, they don't have anything to show for themselves. You know, wisdom is everywhere, but it's not all good wisdom. The Bible says there's wisdom from above and there's wisdom from below. And so what happens when you get caught in the land of opinion? You never know the truth. And if you never know the truth, you're never free. And that's why David is saying, let the word of the Lord be your final authority. There's opinions on marriage. There's opinions on creation. There's opinions on where did, you know, uh, how did man evolve? How did man, you know, how did the, me on medicine? There's opinions on, you know, healing. There's opinions on when is Jesus coming back? And there's opinions on everything, especially on your social uh, issues of the day, you know, like abortion. You know, and like some of the other uh, issues that are before our Supreme Court. Listen to me. You know, you don't have to be swayed by public opinion. You don't have to be swayed by the gurus of late night talk or the newspapers. That Word of God. Make up your mind today that the Word is going to be my final say so. I'll hear, I'll hear, I'll hear. But at the end of the day, I bring everything to the Word of God, and that's what settles it. If you do that, you'll know the truth. And if you know the truth, you'll be free. That's your word for the week.